dada babysitter test. Look, you only have one hour to complete this test. Feed a newborn, burp a newborn, play with a newborn, talk with a newborn. I had no idea there was going to be a newborn section of this test. We don't have a newborn. Oh dear. We have to get Tilly to that. Today. Rosie, you're so cute. Why are you so cute? Why are you so cute? I'm glad we have Rosie to be with while we wait for our babysitter test to come. Yeah, I'm glad we did the test right now. We test the baby so the test is hard. Yes, there are six sessions that you have to complete before you become a professional baby bail babysitter. <laughs> That's the doorbell. I wonder if it's our test. <gasps> I can't only wait. There you are. Here's your toy, and here's mine. I wonder what this test is about. Hmm. This looks kind of complicated. Maybe we should come on to see what all these things are for. Mom! Yes? What's going on, girls? We got a finally got that babysitter test in the mail. Look. What did it mean? Hmm. This must be the first section. It says, Babyville Babysitter Test, Section 1, 0 to 3 months, newborn care. And it has nine things that you girls have to check off in order to complete it. But that's not the thing that um, looks hard. Look, you only have one hour to complete this test from upon receiving it. How are we going to do that? Oh, dear. Feed a newborn, burp a newborn, play with a newborn, talk with a newborn, soothe a newborn, give a newborn a passy, put a headband on a newborn, put a newborn to sleep, and tummy time for a newborn? How are we going to get this all done, girls? But, Mom, that's not what I'm really concerned about. Really? What are you thinking? We don't have a newborn. How are we going to play this new section? Oh, that's right. We have a lot of babies, but... None of them are between zero and three months. None of them are newborn. Clay and Quill are over a year old. I mean, 12 months old. They are not newborns. Margaret's little, but she's not a newborn. Even Katie Water's not a newborn. Any more, she's four months old. Noelle is certainly not a newborn. She's like almost eight months old. Bonnie Bell is this like four months too. And Kai, he's six months old. You are going into a big board. <sighs> How will other complete this test? How will other complete personal babysitters? But we can't pass the first section of this test. <laughs> hmm. I'm sorry, girls. And they only have an hour to complete it. Let me go check on something, though. Here, you come with me. Mom! Oh, what, girls? Um, could we just bought some baby doll videos to see how we could take care of babies for you to come what you want to look at? Oh, sure, I guess so. Amy Sanchez just posted a new video I think you might like. Oh, yay! Some videos of newborn care. Our newborns are so cute. <laughs> okay, let's see. Phew, it's a good thing I ordered something for the girls today. I think it should definitely help them with their test. The only problem is we only have an hour to complete that test. Let me see when it's supposed to arrive. It should be here in about five minutes. Phew, it's a lifesaver in order for them to pass this test. 
Whoa, well, do, do you want to get down? Maybe she wants to go outside and play. a neat show. Oh! That's the doorbell. it is. Girls, you probably want to come check on it. Oh, I can't wait to show you girls what this is. What is it? It's empty. An empty box? Oh my goodness. What, what is, is it, it, Mom? Oh, no. What are we going to do about your test? What do you mean? Girls, I just bought two Lovabella newborns for you. And they're gone! You bought two newborn Lovabellas? I did, but they're not in there. That's the box they were was supposed to be delivered. Where can they be? I don't know. We're going to have to look for clues. I hope no one stole them. What is this? Oh, that's Rosie's bum. Hmm, that gives me an idea. Are you changing what I changing? Sure thing, Toria. I wonder if Rosie is the culprit. I wonder if those two Lovabella newborns that we need to pass your test, if they're hidden somewhere around the house. Where could they be? We gotta go look for them. Rosie have put it. I put those dolls. We need to find them fast. Nope, not in here. Nope, not in there. We've looked just about everywhere for them. Where could they be? Has has anyone seen Rosie? Um, I haven't. The last time I saw her, they were watching baby doll shows. They wanted to get down and play. I wonder if Rosie took those. We've got to find it. Where could it be? <laughs> oh, did you hear that? I think I heard Rosie barking. She's coming from from over here. Rosie, Rosie, did you put the baby doll somewhere? Oh, I see something. Oh my, Christy, you found yours. Rosie hid it under the bed, but we have to help Toria find hers. Come on, Toria, let's go find yours. Where could Rosie have hid it? Go look, go look. Maybe in here because she's supposed to be in it. Rosie, where did you hide Toria's? Mm, I wonder if it could be in here. Oh my goodness, look. Oh, we found them, girls. These will help you pass your newborn Babyville professional baby doll sitter test. Let's open them right now. Christy's getting the bottle out. These Lovabella dolls come with a bottle and a passy. Oh my goodness, look at how cute this passy is. <gasps> you won't believe it. These dolls are so cute. Oh. That's Oh, she's so cute. Mine has blonde hair and blue eyes. And mine has blonde eyes and blonde hair. She's a little face and she's precious. 
boy, I'm so glad I got these dolls just in the nick of time. I had no idea there was gonna be a newborn section of this test. Oh, look at them. What sweet little newborns we have here. Oh, Victoria's little brown eye newborn. We have no time to lose. That's right, we only have about 30 minutes to complete this complicated newborn professional babysitter test. We've got to get started now. We have less than 30 minutes to finish this now. This is gonna be tricky, but I'm so glad that these babies came just in time. Okay, girls, first thing on the list is... Three day newborn. I need to get a bottle. Aww. Aww. Oh, it seems like something's wrong. Is she taking her bottle? Sometimes newborns have troubles taking bottles. Oh, yours is so cute. <laughs> they are so cute. Mine is so cute too. Yours is so cute. I think the love of Bella has to be on the top so she can drink it. Now try it. Oh, there we go. Now she loves it. Well, I say you girls are for sure passing your feeding test. I need to take that up off my list. What's the next thing on my list? The next thing on the list says burp a newborn. Time to burp. Quickly, girls. Oh, oh I heard her burp. Has she burped? She burped. Did she burp too? Yes. Burping is three times. Three times. That's definitely a success. Okay, this is going good. Hopefully, we don't bump into any mishaps. Wow, these girls have a lot of burps. So I'm gonna go ahead and check them off because they're still burping over there. For Christy and Toria. She likes to suck your finger. Oh. <laughs> She sure does. The next thing on the list, girls, is play with a newborn. How should you play with her? So newborns, you can't just like bounce around or throw them a ball. You have to play with them a different way. Hmm. Let me go get some baby toys and we can play baby toys with that. What's going on? Oh no, we can't put them to sleep yet. We still have playtime on our chart. I just got the toys. Let's see if we can wake them up. We're gonna have to wake her up. Here's a toy for her. And here's a toy for that baby. Time to play. Oh, don't go to sleep, babies. Oh dear, that is something with newborns. They fall asleep so easily or it's hard to put them to bed. When you want them up, they go to sleep. And when you want them to sleep, sometimes they stay awake. So hopefully we can wake these babies up. We only have half an hour to finish this. Uh, this is gonna be a challenge for sure. Are they waking up, girls? Are they waking up? Oh good, 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 play with them, play with them. Oh, she has her little rattle on her wrist. Good. Oh, hold them like a newborn though, support their head. There you go, Oh, Are she falling back to sleep? Oh no. We can check out the play with newborns because they've definitely done that. Okay, we've got to move through this fast. The next thing on the list is to talk to a newborn. Talking to a newborn can be kind of a one-sided conversation, but go girls, go! Oh, she thinks that's funny! Oh, oh, look it! Singing to a baby is a great way of talking to them. They love it, listen to them. Okay, can definitely check off talk with newborn. You girls are doing awesome. Girls, we're about halfway done. The next one on the list is soothe the newborn. Can you rock them? Oh, yes. Oh, she's almost going to sleep. Mom, do you need to get off of me? Of course. How much time it has left, Mom? Ooh, we only have about 10 minutes left. We got to get busy. Next thing on the list is give the babies a pacifier. I hope they take these well. Not all babies take pacifiers. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome, Toria. Is she gonna take it? 
she's taking hers pretty well. This one just doesn't seem to be working quite as well. Oh, poor baby. Oh, she's kind of sad about it. Oh, there she goes. Oh, wow. This has been the first time it's been quiet in a little bit. These little girls can be noisy. But listen, they're all peaceful right now taking their passies. Okay, we're down to about seven minutes and we still have three more to go. Girls, we need to put headbands on the babies. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome, Tori. Oops, you can get tangled. Putting on a headband on a newborn isn't as easy as it looks. Can you do it, Christy? She's getting hers. Christy, you did it too. Okay, girls, there's just two things left. Tummy time and putting a newborn to sleep. Those are both very challenging things to do for a newborn. Okay, let's get started. I'll help you. Spreading a blankie out for tummy time. We've got to get this done. The babies are seriously starting to get kind of sleepy. Bring the girls over for tummy time. Babies don't always like tummy time, but it's so good for their neck muscles. Oh, it's okay, little one. Oh, it's okay. Oh, look at she's actually lifting her head up a little bit. Wow, she's getting strong. And so is she. They're acting so sleepy. I think we better put them to sleep, don't you think, girls? Mm -hmm. We don't like to hurry all the time, but we only have three minutes left. Is she falling asleep? Oh, Tori, is this falling asleep? She's actually snoring. Listen. This little girl over here is so energetic and just staying awake. You've got to put her to sleep to pass the test, Christy. Oh, yes, yeah, sweet kisses. Hey, I'm getting a little nervous about this. Or you just put hers to sleep. She was falling asleep when I was singing um, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Maybe I should sing that. Maybe she likes to be sung to sleep. Try it, Christy. Twinkle Twinkle. Look at that. This one likes to be sung to to go to sleep. Oh, she is out. You knew it, Christy. You knew exactly what she needed. Girls, do you know what that alarm means? What? You got your test and you passed. Well, this girls, it's a new day. Yeah. Are you enjoying your breakfast? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I think I do too. We should go check on them. It's time to get their day started. Well, I'm not sure. It's our first morning with these babies, and we wanted to show you their morning routine. But I guess what we really want now is your help in deciding what their name should be. These precious little babies, they need names. There's that one. And this one. We need to find two names for them. Well, I know what we're going to be working on today. Whew, sometimes picking names can be hard. Oh, and she's thinking her cat is so good. It's a name for brown eyes. Brown eyes? Well, I think we're going to have a lot of ideas on what to name them. So I'm glad we had you all along today, and I hope we can get this figured out. Come on, girls, let's get their bottles. I'm glad we made balls for the babies last night. Time to warm them up. Babies are getting pretty hungry. Almost. 
Okay, your bottles are coming soon. I see it done. Okay, it should be coming soon, babies. Need to stuck a little bit on my waist. Perfect. It's not too hot. I'm too much cold. Fussy there. Oh wow, they are hungry babies. I knew they were. Oh my goodness, look at this sweet girl. When I see her, she just looks like a rose to me. No, Mom, when I see her, she just looks like a posy. Posy? If I see her, I look like a Melissa. Melissa? I don't know if this naming thing is going to go very well today, but we've got to get them named. They're so cute, they need names. What do you think she looks like? She definitely looks like a thing. Jay? I thought she looked like a hazel. Hazel? Well, in my mind, she definitely looked like an Olivia. Uh-oh. I know, this name thing is not going that smoothly. We have to settle on their names today. Oh, she's getting full. Well, even if we can't decide on their names, at least their feeding is going well. Look at how sweet she is. Oh, And Krista, you're just a pro at feeding babies. Look at how relaxed she is. Whether she's a rose, a posy, or any other name. Now it's time to put them. Morning, Mitchie's on my face. Morning, Mitchie's on my face. While they finish doing the feeding, it takes a while to feed newborns. I'll take you and let's go pick out some clothes for them for their new day. Here we go. I have these cute little matching outfits that I thought would look so cute on them. I have different headbands for them, but aren't these just so cute? I think they'll look really cute. And even though they're not identical twins, they look really similar. And I think those matching outfits will look really cute on them. Girls, are they done eating yet? They just finished. Perfect. I just got their clothes all set up. Bring them on in. Here are their clothes. Let's put them out and get them dressed. Okay, baby. Oh. They're doing so well. Many times newborns don't actually like their clothes taken off and getting dressed. So I'm really glad that they're so brave. They're looking cute too. It's okay, little, little. Oh boy, we've got to name these girls. I just want to call them something, but they don't have a name. But they will soon. That's right. They definitely will have a name by the end of today. We're not going to let you go until we tell you their names, which we have to decide on them first. My baby's just sleeping. Your baby's starting to go to sleep. Oh my goodness, look at how cute she is. Oh, I love all those bright, happy colors, little girl. Oh, I definitely think she looks like a Dorothy now. There's just so many names that I like. We can't forget the shoes. She's so cute, she fell asleep. Oh! the doorbell. I wonder what that could be. What are these? Oh my. Baby doll birth certificate. Love Bella newborn name. Due back today. What does that mean? We have to get this back to the baby doll center today with their actual names written down. Now, this is getting serious. We can't be playing around here. We've got to figure out what their names are. We have to get serious about this. That's right. I think we better go to the chalkboard now and write all of our name ideas and pick our favorite ones. First name idea we'll put down is Rose. Next one? Sarah. Sarah. Posey. Posey. Okay, Sally. What about Jane? Olivia. What other ideas do we have? Are any of these your name? 
What is your idea, Toria? I want wolves. I want Katie. Katie? Mm -hmm. Katie? Ava? Olivia? Jane? Sally? Rose? Sarah? Posey? So many ideas, but we just can't pick them. Because we like them all. We need to be able to name these babies. We just can't decide. Oh, well, I think the babies are getting kind of fussy. We might have to put away our chalkboard time and name planning and take them outside for a little walk. Maybe we'll get some good ideas while we're outside. Let's go for a walk. Okay, let's put the let's put the babies in there. Whoa! Oh dear, we had a straw tumble. Gratefully, no babies were in there yet. Okay, girls, let's put our babies in. Oh, this is their first ever stroller ride. Oh, are you excited to be outside? Okay, we're definitely needing some nice fresh air time and a walk will be perfect. And hopefully that'll refresh our brains too so we can come up with the perfect name. She's having fun back there. Oh, well they're all in there and buckled. Where should we take them first on their very first walk? To the park. Okay, let's push them to the park. We made it! Tori, you wanna show them the slide? Oh, are you gonna show how the slide is? What? Ooh, what is there on the slide? Ooh, there's a grasshopper yo, yo, on the yo. slide. Is that okay? Okay, it's not too scary. I think she'll be fine. Whoa! Did she jump away? Yeah. This little girl is adventurous, this newborn. I'm surprised she's willing to go down with you. Oh, it's too hot. Now, Tori said the slide was really hot. Do you think it's going to be too hot for you? <laughs> oh, it's just too hot, isn't it? Well, let's go swing then. Well, maybe I'll take this opportunity while the girls are swinging on their swings to go look for some names on my phone. I know a lot of parents usually look online for ideas, so maybe see if I can find any that we all agree on. I see names like Sophia, Evie, Isla, Ruby, Clara, we already have one of those, Aurora, Scarlett, Esme, Jessica, Chloe, Zoe, Madison, Megan. There's so many amazing names. I don't know if this has helped or made it harder. Oh, well, it looks like they're coming in from the park. Time to put them down for a nap. Hopefully, um, we'll have a couple minutes to maybe I can tell the girls the ideas I found. Do you like any of those that I said? Are any of those your favorite names? Did you girls have fun at the park? Yeah. Oh, I think they love the park. Wow. Wow, Tori. All these babies are kind of cranky and tired. Definitely time for nap time. Boy, that was a nice time at the park, wasn't it, babies? Aww. We thought we'd give the babies a special treat and let them swing during their nap time today. They've never done that before in a real baby swing. It's that little sweetie's turn. Aww. She looks so happy in there. And they can look at these little bees and bugs while they sleep. This is hers and that's hers. Good night, little one. It's okay, babies. This is how we turn it on. Good night, little girls. Oh, look, they're already starting to fall asleep. Does she need her patsy to fall asleep? And this is perfect timing because what do we need to do, Toria? We need to figure out the name. Absolutely. This is getting critical. We have to figure out what to put on these baby doll birth certificates today. So I know we're all just a little bit discouraged about this, but I brought out what our parents used back in the old days to find baby names, and that is huge fat genealogy books so we're just looking in there and look at all these names alma agnes georgia bessie maude there's so many but we like them all how are we ever going to decide on one for the twins what other ones do you see kimsey alice and eliza eleanor mary they're all so pretty but which is our baby's names Oh, I have a deal, Mom. Really? Yeah. What is that? Well, we said all the words we talked about was our name. The way cut to, that's the name they like. And it's the name. Hmm. What do you think about that, Christy? I like that 
idea. Let's try it. Sounds good. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Eleanor, Eliza, Alice, Allie, Jane, Sally, Sophia. It seems like none of these names are, are working. Let's keep playing it. Okay. Let's see. Ellen. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Is that your name? <gasps> I think she loves that name. Is her name Rose? Yes. Oh. How cute she picked her name. It's Rose. Hi, Rose. Oh, we still haven't found this one's name though yet. Sally, Allie, Eleanor. Nora, Esther, Alice. Nope, none of those are it. Sarah. Oh my goodness. She woke up to Sarah. Are you Sarah? Oh, Christy, you picked it. You guessed the right one. Rose and Sarah. Welcome little baby girls. Now we can fill out these birth certificates with Rose and Sarah. 